Hey guys, welcome back. Today, Charlene and I are going to show you how to plant a fruit tree. We're planting that uh, pear tree that I got from Gurney's. Um, so the first thing you want to do is soak your tree roots in water for at least two hours. Get a nice hole dug so you got some loose soil in the bottom and enough room for the roots to spread out good. Then um, I just got a five gallon pail full of compost from behind the barn. So you want to mix some of that in the bottom of your hole. She loves helping me with like everything. And I'm feeling so glamorous today in my oversized hoodie that I stole from Joe. <laughs> You just want to mix that all in. Then you got to add your tree. Like I said, the hole should be big enough so the roots can spread out and they're not compacted. And then you just add your the soil from your hole back in there. I'm putting the rocks back in too, but I'm putting them towards the outside of the hole so they're not on top of the roots. I'm breaking up any big clumps of dirt. It's the wormy the wormy. So and he's so cute. He is. Don't hurt him. Oh, I know it's That's pretty much what you do. You just um, add the soil that you dug out back into the hole, mixing it with some compost. Now you want to make sure you don't bury the grafting union on the tree. You want it probably two to three inches below the grafting union. Now with Gurney's, I don't know about other uh, companies because I haven't ordered trees from any other companies before, but with Gurney's they actually paint like a white mark in, on their tree so you can see where it is. But even if it wasn't there, it's pretty easy to tell where it is because it's just like this bump on the trunk and then you know, you can see where the other part grew on. You just don't want to bury that. Shake the dirt out of them swords. I'll hold this one. You will? It's very strong for me. There's mm. another little baby worm. Ooh, that's wormy. That's wormy. It is? Isn't he cute? He's a baby. Stop it, Dad! <laughs> you yeah, silly girl. Uh, I don't think he's on. Then you just want to gently tamp down the soil all around the tree. 
Just don't go too crazy jumping up and down. <laughs> Then uh, you want to make sure that you water it. Then I'm just going to dump them sods out in the woods. At this point, once you've planted your tree and you've tamped down the soil on the top, you can add fertilizer too. Um, I didn't, I just used the compost. Oh, I forgot to show you this on the little tour I did the other day. We had another casualty. Jackson ran over my little Macintosh while he was learning how to drive the tractor. Oh well. Alright, that's a wrap folks. Thank you for hanging out with us today and we'll catch you on the next one.